All right, I've discovered this app um, by Peter Borg, and it's available at peterborgapps.com slash lingon. And it's a utility that allows you to enable uh, applications, if you like, to run at startup by creating a daemon very easily. Now, the version um, for Yosemite 10.10, .10, Mac OS 10.10 .10 or higher is Lingon X2. Uh, don't get the Lingon X3, which is... or Lang on 3, which is available at the Mac App Store, because it won't allow you to create uh, daemons that run as root, but uh, this one will. And if you're running an earlier version of Mac OS 10, then you can download and install uh, Ling on X, which is available uh, right from here. So that's the one that I've downloaded for this server because I'm running this one on Mac OS 10.9, uh, which is Mavericks. So if I just go to localhost at this time, you'll see that uh, I don't have web services running. It's installed, but it hasn't isn't running yet. I haven't started it up. So I'm going to launch the Lingon app, and I'm going to create a new daemon that I'm going to say that I want it to start as root, and I'll call it fcws start. And what I want it to run is the startup dot command, which is that file here, which is stored inside the Macintosh HD library, first class web services, the start fcws command. So I'll just click on open, and I'm telling it that I want to uh, launch at system startup and when saving. So I'm saving it now. So I'm just going to click on save, enter my admin password, and install the helper. So if this works, I should now be able to go back to localhost, hit enter, and of course now I'm logged in, or sorry, at least now the web services has started. To prove that it works on startup, let me just restart. Actually, let me do one other thing just to prove it. FCWSCTL stop. And refresh, we can see that web services isn't running. So I'll exit Chrome, and I will exit Terminal, and I'm going to restart this computer. So I'll come back uh, when it's uh, just about finished restarting again. Okay, we're started again, and uh, I could try logging in from another computer, and in fact, you'd find that it has already started, but let's just prove it. Uh, it started even before I've logged in, so it's not a login item. It starts when the system starts. And if I open up a browser and just go to localhost, there we see it automatically started web services.